ladies and gentlemen, our, our captain supreme, Alan Bennett. Great, great poker player that he is, ladies and gentlemen. Here he comes. All right, Skip. Right, well, it, as Skipper, you, you get the pleasure of reading out the award of the Players' Player of the Year. So, um, I'm going to hand the mic to you if you want to say a couple of words beforehand, then feel free. Um, so, ladies and gentlemen, Alan Bennett. Thanks, guys. Um, appreciate your support all year. It's been one of them up and down years, but uh, we appreciate your support as a group of players. I'll uh, get right to it. Players' Player of the Year is Barry Fuller. Before you go, Benno, Benno, before you go, as, as the skipper at the club and obviously playing in the back line with Bazzari, can you just give everyone just a few words of just exactly why everybody voted for him as player of the year? Did you vote for him? Yeah, I, I did vote for him actually, yeah. Um, <laughs> no, he's a great lad, great attitude, disciplined, committed, first in the gym every day, last to leave, works hard, and all the lads appreciate that. That'll do nicely, thank you. Alan Bennett, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, when Benno said that about your first in the gym last week, I thought he was talking about me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Pazza, what does it mean to you to win Players Player of the Year? Yeah, it's an honour, obviously, our squad. There's a lot of good players here, and to be voted by your fellow teammates is... Uh, it's a privilege and there's some great boys there and if it weren't for them helping me settle in for my first season I may not be up standing up here but I'd like to thank all the boys for helping me settle in and it's a great squad obviously it's a bit disappointing today but we're looking to kick on next year and hopefully we can keep the squad and build on it and go up sounds brilliant sounds brilliant now now I'm in an awkward position um, You've got your family here, Baz, they're always here, aren't they? Yeah, they're here. I've got my little girls are down there. My oh. mum my mum and wife over there. Would you like to get your little girls up here for a minute? You, you gonna come up, girls? Come on in. Here they come. These three are as cute as they come just by the way, ladies and gentlemen. Look at these three. Brilliant. It... We're full of family, ladies and gentlemen. Now then, let's get let's get your names. What's your name? Gracie. And your name? Evie. Evie. And your name? Scarlett. Scarlett. Scarlet. Right, ladies and gentlemen, this is fantastic. Now, I know you're a big family man, Barry, and, and this club is like one big family. Uh, are, are you feeling the love? Yeah, definitely. Uh, as I said in a few interviews I've done this year, uh, some of the away trips we've had and some of the support that we've had, it's been amazing. I don't think I've had it at most clubs that I've been in my career and obviously with them, they help in that 12th man sometimes. That's good stuff, isn't it? Brilliant. So now I'm going to ask Maureen to read out who our, um, our wizard, Alan Batsford Player of the Year, as voted for by you, the fans. Here we go, Maureen. Barry Fuller. He didn't get too far back there, did he? Come on, Bazza. <laughs> Yes, uh, we're getting very professional around here. Thank 
Right, Maureen, you got anything you want to say to everybody here? I think it's well deserved. I thought that. <laughs> there you go. So the right man's got the right prize yet again. So, ladies and gentlemen, one more round of applause for Maureen Batsford. Thank you, Maureen. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for the longest servant at this club. Please put your hands together for the one and only Simon Bassey. <laughs> Right, Bassi, you know, I've asked him a couple of questions. We're going to ask him a couple more in a minute. Um, and Ben has already said what a great player he is, but obviously you're on the coaching staff, so you work with him day in, day out. Just um, do us a favour and uh, tell everybody here just a little bit what it's like to work with our, our player of the year in more ways than one. Yeah, fantastic. I mean, I think Ben O's uh, spoke brilliantly about Baz. I remember we were looking for a right back in the summer. I spoke to Mark Beardy, you all remember Beardy? Yeah. He was a tough kid. He said, take Barry Fuller, he runs through brick walls. And he's, <laughs> he's run through 46 of them today. <laughs> this season, fantastic, every week. Not one wing has given him a tough time. He's been top class all season. That just about sums it up, doesn't it? How are you feeling now then? Embarrassed. <laughs> Shocked to be honest. Uh, I know I'm not the most talented and going to do quests and stuff like that. But, uh, Hang on a minute, yeah. Tell him what you think of that, ladies and gentlemen. Not the most talented. Rubbish. Go on. No, not, in, not saying that, but there are there's gifted players out there that obviously can go and turn people inside out every single week. But I've always been taught, and my upbringing from my mum and dad is you work hard and if you work hard, it improves. And obviously, I've come here, I've worked hard with a great group of staff and lads. And obviously, thank you for the fans, everyone that's voted for me. That made me feel welcome since I've been here. That's brilliant. So, any boys in the pipeline? <laughs> nah, I think I'm done now. I, I think uh, I'm going to have enough trouble when these grow up, so uh, I'm going to... Uh, me and my wife and the kids, obviously, we're settled now. And obviously, after football, they're, well, they are my life, but whatever they want to do at the moment, I'm cheerleading, dancing, gymnastics with them. So, uh, but no, nah, we're done. I'm happy with my family, my three girls, as much as everyone says, oh, I do want a boy. If you look at them, what more can I ask for? Yeah, that's fantastic. Fantastic. <laughs> any of them any good at football? Yeah, Evie. Evie's quite good, to be fair. She loves playing, so the other two, ball's too dirty for them too, but... <laughs> <laughs> but no, she's good. Oh, that's brilliant. Ladies and gentlemen, I I've got to say, thank you very, very much for staying behind today. Thank you to all the players. Ladies and gentlemen, the whole squad is here. So let's have a massive round of applause for the whole squad, please. I just want to say just a couple of things before, before we finally go. Ladies and gentlemen, as always at this club, there are shed loads of volunteers that have worked their socks off again this year. I would like to thank all the volunteers and all the staff, everyone that's contributed to, to what we do. Let's have a massive round of applause.